Hi, my name is Kate, and I will be explaining to you how your baby's brain is developing while in utero. Within 16 days of conception, your fetus's neural plate begins to form. At two months, their neural tube, which includes their brain, spinal cord, and other neural tissue, becomes well formed. At 16 weeks, your baby's brain directs contractions of the diaphragm and chest muscles. And this will allow them, at 21 weeks, their natural reflexes, which will allow your baby to swallow several ounces of amniotic fluid. By the end of trimester two, their brainstem is almost entirely formed. That will control their heart rate, breathing, and blood pressure. At the third trimester, your baby's brain will triple in weight. It'll grow from 3.5 ounces at the end of the second trimester to 10.6 ounces at term. Their brain will also look different. It'll no longer be smooth. It will become grooved and indented like we see in full adult grown brains. Their cerebellum, which controls their motor control actions, is also developing fast. That surface area will increase 30 fold in the last 16 weeks. If the mother has problems during pregnancy, such as high maternal cortisol levels, this could link the child with high blood pressure, type 2 diabetes, and cardiac disease later in life. If the mother is experiencing depression while pregnant, this shows increased fetal heart rate and increased fetal startle responses. Anxiety in an expecting mother can also cause behavioral and emotional problems in children. With our modern ultrasound imaging, right now that provides imagery of a growing fetus but because of the skull it's hard to distinguish brain tissues with new mri imaging doctors can find asymmetries which can be a useful power marker for abnormal development while in the womb an example of how mri has been used to find these abnormalities is that when there's a higher diffusity in parietal white matter and the thalamus in fetuses, that most likely means that they will have a congenital heart defect. Doctors are working on finding more ways to identify cell growth and migration in a growing fetus's brain. The last five years, there's been a lot of research, but with increasing technology, there will be more ways to study their developing brains. Their brains are developing very quickly. Adults have 100 billion neurons in their brain. When fetuses are growing, their rate of neuron growth in the womb is 250,000 neurons per minute. Your baby's brain is developing fast and will continue to develop within the first few years of life. Good luck. Thank you.